What's going on, people? Quick update on the pond. Um, I need to get in here and clean it out, but uh, the wife and I have kind of been talking. Um, on my last video I done of the pond, I uh, was guessing that the pond is leaking, um, which is pretty much true. Uh, if you look right down here, I don't know how good we can see it, but you can kind of see right there's the spot it's, it's leaking. Um, I don't know the best way to fix it, but um, I think really for us to have some peace of mind, we're just going to uh, drain the pond, put the fish in some uh, tubs for a couple of weeks, and uh, get this done right instead of having two pieces of liner that seam together um, it makes me feel better that you know it's not going to be like 110 out here in Oklahoma and I'm out here having to, you know to uh, hurry up and put my fish into tubs because I've lost all my water um, that's the last thing I want to do so uh, that's one thing the, uh, the other thing by it uh, starting to warm up and uh, spring coming in. We have started getting wildlife in the pond again this year. Uh, right there's our uh, first set of, I guess uh, they look like toads, um, starting to breed. So uh, yeah, we need to get this done pretty quick so they, uh, they have a place to uh, lay their eggs and the tadpoles. Uh, really cool to see the first of the year. They'll, uh, some of them stick around uh, throughout their year. You'll see frogs in the pond, so that's cool. The other thing is, um, we had to <laughs> replace our sewer line, um, unfortunately. And, uh, when we did, uh, had a bunch of leftover dirt, um, which I'll probably have to, at some point, that'll probably settle, and I'll have to bring in new dirt. But, uh, I was able to, uh, take the dirt and uh, kind of bring it around the back of the, the pond and uh, heap that up more like I've wanted it for quite a while. Uh, so that's how that looks. Um, you know, I gotta get new grass growing on this. But, you know, that was pretty much the damage. Um, now, you know, just grass. Can't really tell, but like I said, it'll probably settle. If that happens, I'll just bring in good topsoil and spread over it but um, that's kind of what the back of the waterfall looks like right now uh, start getting plants on there now they've got the dirt in it'll settle down some so it, it'll it won't be as high as it is right now um, I was going to start doing rock work again this spring but uh, since we're going to replace the pond liner I'm kind of glad I didn't do any more um, last year I uh, was able to also use some of that extra dirt right here so uh yeah that's uh it's kind of our update um you know how things are going uh, another guy right let's see where's he at i know he's there i can see him right there he is he's in there but uh yeah the the fish are starting to move around. I've only seen uh, about one koi in there. Uh, they're probably just taking a little bit longer to decide to come out and swim around. But uh, got several goldfish. I think I counted five so far that's uh, swimming. So uh, yeah, excited to see the uh, pond going. But uh, dogs are starting to bark, so probably can't hear. So I'm going to cut it short. So talk to you guys later. Let me know what you think.